It is time to get good. I need to practice my timing, specifically blocking and power bashes. And power attacks too. Bull rushing is also really powerful. And we'll take enemies right out. So the idea is to make enemies defenseless. I have figured out I don't like dodge. I've never liked dodge, not even for evasion characters. You think you can take me? <laughs> <laughs> Man, I could level up heavy armor with this guy all day. Azura curse you. But I'd rather do power bash. So I only have two-handed of 39, so I can't do sprinting power attacks. And I'll practice those when I get two-handed to 50. But what I can work on right now is bull rushing, power attacks, and power bashes. I'll show you what I feel or Please don't kill me. Really, in combination, they're pretty devastating. And if you time it right, they're pretty helpless. Even if they have a shield, even if they can block. I have a video on it that power bashes are not regular bashes. They're much harder. I cannot best you. So that was a scroll that uh, did the Conjured Wolf. And it occurs to me how powerful conjuration in two-handed heavy armor will be. So I got a nice uh, haul. I brought everything back and recycled it. Really like recycling. And I want to level Restoration. Do some Alchemy for cash. And for some buffs. There you are. I did. Your time, it seems, has come. So I'm told. Let's see if you impress. Restoration allows me to do a healing aura, but more importantly, protection from poison. And that's not bad. Even a low-level potion now will make me pretty much immune to paralysis uh, or paralyze, which is what I want. And two-handed weapons are just fun. They really are. If you take nothing from this video, this chest right here is where you want to store everything for the end of the quest. 51 is the magic number for magic resistance, for avoiding, for being able to uh, shrug off Draugr shouts. Okay. 
Okay, and after some um, cutscenes. Yeah, I think I hit my companion more than I hit the uh, silver hand. And at that point, I bring everything back and put it in this chest because it'll be waiting for me right by the exit door. And that's almost always the way it works. So, yeah, I can put everything in here and pick it up on the way out. There's almost always a container by the front door. Inventory management, it's a thing. It's a skill. I am almost never over-encumbered, accidentally. I'm never surprised by being over-encumbered. I'm starting to feel that my companion is then in the way. Okay, the way to level 2 hand is to uh, not power attack, but do the maximum number of swings. But man, power attack is so much fun. Eventually I give up. Eventually I realize I just want to one-hit everything. But for a little while, I used some restraint. But when I started playing this character, or before I started playing this character, what drew me to this character was the idea of one-hitting everything with a greatsword. And I really, really enjoyed killing Draugr with a silver greatsword. That, that was probably... It was one of the most fun things. I spend half of the game with blurry vision, it feels like. I'll never do that again. Um, I, um, some of the times my vision was blurry for so long it gave me a headache, and I'm never going to do that again. It, it will make you physically nauseous. I love Requiem, but it's not worth headaches and feeling nauseous. No. So this is the last game I'm going to do that. This is the point where I just want to one-hit everything. And pretty much it stays that way. I try to use restraint and get and level up two-handed, but... Man, it's one-hitting everything with a two-handed weapon is just the best. So this is just a beating. This is just one of the... I mean, it's always a beating, but... This, with a two-handed weapon, I was surprised. Something to kill. Looking. I'm gonna Watch it there, sister. Watch it, sister. I'm racing against Farkas trying to get as many kills and hits as possible.
You know, I brought these things for this. I might as well use them. But this is just a slaughter. I thought I'd have to take health potions and stamina potions to do this, but this is just a beating. That's all there is. Wow. Okay, so I go back to the chest and take everything I want out. Yep, we bad. I'm just gonna walk out of here. This feels really good. It sometimes just you finish a quest and it just feels really good. And I'll take this. That's right, I'll take this. Lasgar is becoming really fun to play. So still short for two-handed, 50, but uh, that's okay. That, that was fun as it was. Brothers and sisters of the circle, today we welcome a new soul into our mortal fold. Yes, lass, you've been raised into the companions I hear. I can fashion whatever kind of weapon you want. Finest forge in Skyrim, right here before you. I really want the battle axe. But I'll take the greatsword. Sure you can handle that? <laughs> of course you can. It's a good sword. It's, um, I think, orc quality. Which is great. But I'll stick with the ebony weapon. See you next episode.